Hey there. Yeah, you. I'm Father Luke Fletcher from the Friars of the Renewal, and I'm the chaplain at Our Lady of Fatima of Blue Army Shrine in New Jersey. Now, I'm not about to start a stand-up comedy show, but I promise you, you'll smile. Have you ever heard of the World Apostola of Fatima? Or as the cool kids say, Our Lady's Blue Army? It's not your typical army. Imagine an army where the weapons are rosaries and the strategy is God's love. The Blue Army is a spiritual response to the message of Our Lady at Fatima. Imagine us, an army on our knees, opening our hearts to Mary's heart. It's like a spiritual workout for your soul. We're all about prayer, sure, but we're also about fun and living our faith in the real, sometimes clumsy ways. We're not just holy rollers, we're holy stumblers, just like you. But seriously, folks, it's about bringing peace and hope to our chaotic world. And you, yes, you, can be a part of this epic mission. When you take the Blue Army Pledge and you enlist yourself in Our Lady's Army and she's right. our general, yeah. you become part of the solution for even all of the unbelievers, right. even the people who don't oh, know our Lord. Question. So we need to do our part, and that's the key, that we take that action. We, of course, devotion and reparation, the basic gospel message, but then we also do these extra steps, the sure. Blue Army Pledge that Our Lady wants for our time for the triumph of Mary. Hello, my name is Patrick Sabat with the World Apostolate of Fatima. What does it mean to sanctify something? When we sanctify our day and all that happens in it, we make it holy by offering it to God, meaning everything that we are tasked with doing according to our duties and all our trials, sorrows, and joys that may come with that. Sister Lucia, the Fatima seer, said this was the most essential message of Our Lady of Fatima to make holy our duties every day according to our state in life. For those who believe no proof is necessary, for those who do not, none will suffice. So you can even see the sun spinning like that. Some walked away probably just, I mean, I, I can't imagine how many would have that day. And I know many skeptics were converted at the, uh, at, at the miracle right. of the sun. And that miracle was, was so phenomenal that, you know, nobody could have predicted that for one, certainly not three little children, totally unexplainable. The scientists couldn't explain it. They said there was no solar phenomenon that happened that day. And yet they saw the sun leaving its orbit and appearing to plunge down to the earth. You know, one person he who was a witness to this when he was 17 years old, he said he, he was looking around at the crowd because of the wails and the cries and the people confessing sins that the crowd just erupted in, you know, lots of murmuring and, and yelling and shouting. And he turned and he saw the sun actually touch his shoulder and he could feel the heat. So that's how far down that sun came. That's why we want to be Marian maximalists, not Marian minimalists. I like that. Yes, right? It, like like yeah. you said, you can't believe 99% of the Catholic faith. You need to believe 100% of the Catholic right. faith. Right, right. Our Lady does not want you to do, she's not asking us to do 90% or three quarters of the Blue Army Pledge, which right. came, which Sister Lucia drafted herself sure. and was approved by the bishop who said promulgate this is coming from this me it's coming from me she wants you to do 100 yes. percent of the blue army pledge yeah. to merit the triumph of the immaculate heart Absolutely. of mary there's no other way yeah and if we do that i guarantee we're going we're going to change the world and we're going to win right there's no doubt i mean you know and, and, and it's you know again i always say it's darkness right before the dawn i think right now we're looking at a very dark period it's getting darker but i do think that we are you know i think we're at a point where where we're on the right track Hey, you there. Yes, you with the backpack. Ever thought of joining an army of peace? No? Well, there's always a first time. Join the fun. Embrace Our Lady's plan for peace. Join the Blue Army.